Okay, so here it is. It's working. I've got a surround panner that I've created in Pro Tools. It's a 5.1 output uh, on this aux track with a signal generator on it. And this 5.1 uh, source in the Dadman is coming from Pro Tools. And then here's my speaker output. Um, and you'll notice that there's two meters there. I have my uh, signal generator uh, panned all the way to the left rear. There's the right rear. That should be two channels as well. And also I can see the same thing. These are the, the in the D to A section. Here's six and eight. So I would want those two surround speakers on the right side to be patched into output channels six and eight. And then on this one, it's five and seven. And to recap, what, what I did here to make this work is in the monitor profile, I created um, a group format um, if one doesn't already exist. I called it 5-1 Array. And it's <clears throat> actually eight channels. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And that is made by um, creating a new profile and specifying what speakers you have. So left, center, right, no sides, no tops number of surround pairs is two pairs, number of sub is one, and then you name it whatever you want. I already have it created, so I don't need to create another one, but there it is, and then here's all the speakers as I just created it. I'm gonna delete that. And then I also created in the fold down tab, actually um, the opposite. I went from five one up to seven one, so I created a new matrix and the input is 5-1 the output is 7-1 and the gain is the same until you get to the two surrounds on each side i i gained it down by three i don't know it might might need more might need minus six i'm not sure you'd want to probably measure it out and then in the group section back in my monitoring uh, where I create the monitor inputs and outputs sources. Of course, I have a, F a Pro Tools 5.1, and that's looking at the Digi link, and that should be six channels wide. It is. And then on the outputs is where my speaker sets are. I've got three in here. This new output set, I would name it um, 5.1 array, and choose the format. Uh, as 5-1 array, the new custom format that we just created a second ago. So that array actually has eight channels, even though I'm calling it 5-1 array, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And of course, you would assign these <coughs> um, speakers to, in my case, I'm using my analog outputs to get to my speakers. So D to A1, which is the monitor left, and then monitor right, so on. And here's my left rear five and left rear two is seven. Right rear one is six. Right rear two is eight. Main outputs fold down. I need to add uh, that five one up to seven one fold up or up, up, I forget the term. Add fold down five one up to seven one. So that's now in the list of fold down options for that output the speaker sets and here it is down here so I'll turn that on if I turn that off I'll lose the second rear so I turn that on bring up my panner and if I go to right rear I see it over here as a single channel but it's being split out to two channels to two speakers actually I should say and here's my D to A I can see the, the metering there as well hopefully this helps